I've had a lot of requests to do the roof video for the shed and uh, I finally found the SD card that had all the footage. It's missing some footage so you won't see any footage of the primer going on but you'll see you know basically what I used and how I did it and a after picture which is like months later and it still looks pretty good. There's some dirt on the roof but you'll get the point. Um, hope this helps. Today I'm going to be working on a project and it's going to be the shed. I wanted to start working on other projects so actually I was thinking about renaming the channel to upkeep with my and my jeep or and a jeep. Uh, we'll see how that goes but for now working on the shed it's full of rust. The roof is full of rust all over the place and uh, I didn't see a lot of stuff online so I wanted to make a video. I got some products I want to show you and uh, here we go I'll show you right now. So I ordered a rust reformer on Amazon. It was a jug. I thought it was going to be this size. My mistake, I didn't check how much the weight of it was. It's actually this little thing. That's the little jug. So hopefully it'll be enough for the roof. I'm only treating the roof with this. South Florida in the sun. It's been baking. It's totally full of rust. And uh, I'll show you right now. There is the rust. Pretty bad. So also going to be using this clean metal primer after the reformer. It says wait uh, four hours and then an aluminum color. These are oil based. I want it to look like kind of like a Key West like tin roof style so I got the aluminum could have could have gotten the white but I think it'll look pretty cool haven't decided on the color of the shed yet so I want it to match the house I've poured a little bit of it in here I'm gonna use a roller as much as I can and then touch it up with an old brush so here we go is after the coat of the rust reform I'll show you the other side this is without comparison with the rust reform without I don't know it's maybe hard to tell with the Sun Hey there, back the next day, finished the uh, rust reformer portion and also the primer. It got late last night, but the battery died. I didn't have any charged, so I went ahead and did that. And uh, it says 24 hours until you do the main portion, which I'm going to do aluminum. Um, and wow, what a difference from uh, rust. But 
it's uh this is really hard to do with all of the, the this what i eventually eventually did was had a paintbrush taped duct tape to a pole did this portion and then i rolled everything else um you can see some of the rust is actually seeping through so hopefully it doesn't with the aluminum i might have to cut this down but on to the last coat This, need, this is just primer, so it needs to be painted. But what a difference from what it first was. All right, everybody, that's uh, the roof of the shed. Thanks for watching. Thanks for the comments on the last video, or I might not have even gone to go look for all that footage. Again, this is a year later. Still looks great. And I'm happy with the way it turned out. Please like and subscribe. I'll put the link of uh, painting the rest of the shed in the description below. So be sure to watch that also to get the complete restoration of the shed.